Welcome to another deep dive into the extraordinary world beneath the waves. Today we're exploring one of the ocean's most mysterious and long-lived residents, the Greenland shark. We'll uncover why they might be the oldest vertebrates on Earth, the curious parasite that often leaves them blind, their astonishingly slow lifestyle, and even a surprising recent discovery that shows these ancient giants turning up in unexpected places. Stick around as we reveal all things Greenland shark. The Greenland shark, Somniosis microcephalus, is a colossal but seldom seen predator that patrols the deep, frigid waters of the North Atlantic and Arctic Oceans. Reaching lengths of up to 6.5 to 7 meters, or over 20 feet, and weighing more than a ton, these sharks are among the largest carnivorous sharks, rivaling even the great white in size. But unlike their swifter cousins, Greenland sharks live life in the slow lane. They have a robust, torpedo-shaped body, a rounded snout, and a relatively small pair of fins. Their coloration typically ranges from brownish-gray to blackish-brown, blending seamlessly with their dark, icy depths that they call home. Although not as intently recognizable as a great white or a hammerhead, the Greenland shark's subtle appearance hides some truly astonishing secrets. Greenland sharks thrive in extremely cold waters, often between negative 1 and 4 degrees Celsius, or 30 to 39 degrees Fahrenheit. They inhabit the depths of the Arctic and the North Atlantic, frequently spotted around Greenland, Iceland, and Canada. But here's where it gets interesting. While historically associated with polar regions, recent research has revealed these slow-moving giants in places that stretch their known range. In 2022, researchers were stunned to encounter what appeared to be a Greenland shark in the warm Caribbean waters near Belize. This unexpected sighting challenged previous assumptions and hinted that these ancient predators might have a far broader habitat range than we ever imagined. Just one more reminder of how little we truly know about the deep sea. The Greenland shark's slow, almost lethargic movement, averaging around just half a mile per hour, raises an intriguing question. What do they eat and how do they catch it? Surprisingly, their diet is quite varied. They're known to feed on fish such as halibut and flounder, and they've even been found with the remains of marine mammals like seals in their stomachs. But how does a shark that moves at a snail's pace manage to catch a fast and agile animal like a seal? Scientists believe that Greenland sharks may utilize stealth and patience. They might ambush seals at breathing holes in the ice or sneak up on sleeping seals near the water's surface. Opportunistic predators that capitalize on moments when their prey is vulnerable. Beyond their hunting, these sharks are not above scavenging. They've been found with the remains of drowned polar bears and even a whole reindeer has been documented in their bellies. This suggests a highly opportunistic feeding strategy, seizing any nutrient-rich meal that drifts into their deep, dark realm. One of the most peculiar aspects of Greenland sharks is their frequent blindness. A small parasitic crustacean often attaches itself to the shark's cornea, feeding on the tissue of their eyes. This parasitic relationship commonly leaves the shark with severely reduced vision or even complete blindness. But here's the thing, it doesn't seem to bother them that much. Greenland sharks rely heavily on other senses, particularly their extraordinary sense of smell, to navigate and find food in the dark ocean depths. In these murky environments, eyesight just isn't a top priority, making the loss of vision less of a disadvantage than it might seem. Perhaps the most remarkable claim to fame for the Greenland shark is its extraordinary lifespan. These sharks are exceptionally slow growing, only about one centimeter per year, and don't even reach maturity until they're around 100 to 150 years old. Scientists have used radiocarbon dating of islands proteins to estimate their ages, and the results have been astonishing. One individual was estimated to be around 392 years old, making the Greenland shark the longest living known vertebrate on the planet. While rumors once circulated about a 512-year-old Greenland shark, the best supported evidence hovers around that 392-year mark. Still, this kind of longevity is nothing short of jaw-dropping. Imagine a shark quietly swimming through the Arctic waters centuries before the Industrial Revolution, witnessing countless environmental changes, yet continuing to glide through the deep, barely noticed by humankind. Current research efforts aim to understand how Greenland sharks achieve this remarkable longevity. 
Some scientists suspect that their unique genetic factors and exceptionally slow metabolism help them resist diseases and stressors that would fell other species much earlier. In fact, studies have identified special genes that might shield Greenland sharks from certain diseases, though the precise mechanisms remain a mystery waiting to be unraveled. Much of our Greenland shark reproduction remains elusive, mostly because they live in such remote, inhospitable habitats, making them challenging to study. We know that they are ovoviviparous, which means that they carry their eggs internally and give birth to live young. Yet, the exact mating habits, gestation periods, and nursery grounds remain shrouded in darkness. The truth is, we still have more questions than answers about this ancient shark's private life. For indigenous communities in Greenland and throughout the Arctic, the Greenland shark has long held cultural significance. Once, a long time ago, some folklore regarded these powerful, secretive creatures as semi-divine, demigod-like beings. Historically, their liver oil was harvested to make lamp fuel, and their flesh, after a careful fermentation process to remove toxins, is a traditional Icelandic dish known as hakarl. Despite their remote habitat, climate change and shifting ocean conditions may increasingly impact these sharks. Warming oceans and melting ice could alter their feeding grounds or prey availability. Overfishing of deep sea ecosystems might also indirectly affect these giants. Though they're not commercially fished on a large scale today, the Greenland sharks' long lifespan and slow reproductive rate make them highly vulnerable to population declines if pressures mount. Protecting this ancient predator ultimately means safeguarding the cold, clean waters it calls home. In recent years, scientific interest in Greenland sharks has grown steadily. The unexpected sighting in tropical waters off Belize in 2022 made headlines, challenging long-held assumptions about their range and adaptability. Increased use of remote-operated vehicles or ROVs, advanced tagging technology, and improved genetic analysis offers hope that we'll soon learn more about these enigmatic giants. Every new data point brings us closer to understanding how Greenland sharks navigate changing oceans and maintain their unprecedented longevity. From their near lightless world beneath ice-laden seas to their incredible centuries-long lifespans, Greenland sharks challenge our understanding of what's possible in nature. They move slowly, grow slowly, age slowly, yet they've endured, quietly observing the seas for generation upon generation. If you enjoyed this exploration into the life of the Greenland shark, please hit that like button and subscribe for more deep dives into the world's most fascinating marine creatures. Share this video with a friend who loves ocean life and let us know in the comments what marine species you'd like to learn about next. Thanks for watching and stay curious about all things marine life.